All right, guys, we are here today working on a 2007 Kia Amanti with the 3.8 V6. We are doing a camshaft, sorry, not a camshaft, crankshaft position sensor. And Kia decided to be different. Normally, if you know much about cars, you know that they, most auto manufacturers would put them in the front of the motor and the side of the motor. Kia wanted to be different and they put it in the top of the bell housing. And that little plug right here is a crankshaft position sensor. So to get to it, you gotta take a lot of stuff out so you can get it to it nice and easy without breaking anything. So, I already took out the snorkel piece that goes right here, and I didn't find this out until after I went in the wheel well to look in the front of the motor to find out that it wasn't there. So, I did some research, and I found out that they put it in the top of the bell housing. So, when I get more stuff removed and I get a better view, I'll bring you guys back. Alright guys, we're back. And I do apologize, I gave you the first location I said was the incorrect location. I said that the sensor was right here. It, it's not, that's not the sensor. The sensor is right here. Even harder to get to. So... I'll see if I can get that out, and when I do, I'll bring you guys right back. Okay guys, so I don't got it out yet, but I did realize something. Even though the Kia engineer screwed us by putting the sensor in such a hard to get spot, they made it a little easier on unplugging it by putting a jumper wire right here underneath the thermostat housing, so that it makes it a lot easier to unplug. Is this plug right here runs all the way down to the sensor, which it's really, really hard getting your hand down in there to unplug it. So now, once I get it out, I'll bring you guys right back. Oh, guys, we're back. I just got it popped out the hole. I don't got it all the way out yet, but here we go. Alrighty. Oh, this is the old one. Let's go in the car and grab the new one. Here's the new one. It is a Import direct OEM replacement. That's the part number. Here is the new sensor. I apologize about the glare. What's going on here? Hold on, guys. So yeah, that's the old sensor. Let's this time here. Let me see if we can unplug this thing. There's no safety lock on it, which is weird. This thing's never been replaced, so it should have a safety lock on it, but it don't. Oh, there we go. Now it's part. Okay, and here we got the new one. I normally like to put a little bit of anti-seize on the metal parts before I put them in, so that if I ever got to do it again, it means a failure of part. It comes out nice and easy, but I have yet to grab all of my 
stuff from the old garage so far. So I don't have any anti seams. So let's find them. It's right there. Ooh, almost lost it. in the hole. <laughs> That's what she said. Alright, what the... did I do with the bolt? No. That's it. Yeah, that's it. You can tell B's trusty just like everything else on this one. That's what you get for buying a car in Michigan. Everything's rusty and oxidized. This is why I don't like working on cars. But I also like working on cars. It's complicated. But, anyways, guys, yeah. Um, only tool, tool that you really need for the job is focus. Probably not gonna focus because I got a flash on. Oh, well, look at that. Is a 10 millimeter. I prefer six point, but 12 points all I got. My six points missing, so. Now let's go down here. Tighten it up. Mm -hmm. At least it hit the ground. Let's see if I can get a little tighter. Oh, I can't. This one's the net. Whoops. Oh, jeez. Now it's even further under that. I got it.
I really, really hate engineers. Well, yeah, it'd be cool to be one. You make pretty damn good money. But, you know. It's not cool. Nobody likes you. It means you make everybody else's job harder. So, we got that in. Um, next clip you see, all this is going to be back together. Alright guys, I'm back and it's all put back together how it's supposed to be. Everything's plugged in. All the bolts are back where they need to be. No extra f bolts, no extra clips. Everything is how it is when the customer dropped it off. Now, that's how, that is how you change a crankshaft position sensor in a 07 Kia Amanti with a 3.8 V6. Alrighty guys, have a wonderful day, and see you in the next one.